welcome to my cooking lesson. We are making Heather's happy, healthy horse cookies today. Sharla is going to be helping Hello. me out. Hello. Hi. Now, you have to take a look at Sharla's apron. Baker in training because there's a little rumor going around that Sharla has been in a kitchen. We're not sure. Can Maybe we twice. Okay. All Maybe right. twice. Rumor's true. Rumor's true. But we know that she's going to do really well at making these cookies because anybody can make horse cookies. Okay, I'm excited. All right. All right. Now, the first thing that you have to have is oatmeal. We've got flour. We've got molasses. We've got water, a little bit of salt. We've got some sugar. And, of course, the uh, carrots. That's right, the carrots. That's really, really important to have carrots because all horses love carrots. Mm -hmm. So, you ready? Let's get I'm started. Ready. All Let's right. Let's do it. You have to preheat your oven to 350. Okay. We've done that already. Then you get out a baking sheet. Now, this is a sheet that I think is big enough um, for a very, very large horse <laughs> if you're going to make that many cookies. For a lot of cookies. All right. We got to spray this baby down. It doesn't matter if you're making cookies for humans or horses. You don't want them getting all stuck to your pan. All right. Now. We're going to take the most important ingredient. It's carrots. Carrots. And carrots. We're going to steal these. Oh, from we have Steve. such a great assistant today. You might recognize him. <laughs> All right. Um, Charlotte, just throw Dump those them in. in. And I want to just tell everybody, uh, you don't have to use carrots. You can actually use apples. Um, or you can Ooh. use apples and carrots if you want to. It's Get totally... all the carrots here. It's not really up to you. It's really up to your horse. And you know what your horse likes. All right. Now we're going to take the oatmeal because we want to take all the dry ingredients. Now the oatmeal, it's a cup of oatmeal. All right. And we're going to get some flour in there. And now, that's a cup of flour. Did you mention we use two carrots? This is two carrots just grated. Yes. Yep. You can buy carrots grated in the store, so you oh, don't even have to do it easier. yourself. <laughs> I recommend that. All right. Now put a little bit of salt on there, too. All right, just a little bit's good. There we go. And your horse is already sweet enough, but we have to add sugar. You are doing such a great job. Thanks. I feel like I'm accomplishing something today. <laughs> all right. Now, mix all the dry ingredients up. Okay. You want to get the, the dry stuff like mixed up first before we add the, add the uh, wet stuff. And you know, it's really important to make treats for your horses because they're part of your family. I don't care if you have a racehorse, a riding horse, or a lawn ornament. You want to keep those horses happy. They're your pet. Yes. And you want to keep them yes. happy. And to me, like they're like your children. So, mm -hmm. all right. Now let's add this the wet good. stuff. We have, um, yeah, add the molasses. That's cool. We've got a quarter cup of molasses. That's pretty much like liquid sugar. <laughs> yeah. I used it is. to eat sweet feed, which is like oats and molasses when I was a little <laughs> girl, like growing up in the barn. Good stuff. I used to eat cane sugar. <laughs> mm, now the good. water. We've got a half a cup of water. All right. And then just mix it all around. These horses are definitely going to be happy. Yes. You just scoop some up. Don't be afraid to get your hands dirty. Yeah, yeah. And you kind of roll them around. I did. There you go. And set them right up there. All right. Okay, Charla, they have cooked for 15 minutes at 350, and through the magic of television, I don't have to use a uh, oven mitt. <laughs> and they have come out so beautifully, and you can add oh, powdered sugar. They look wonderful. Yeah, they are wonderful. Your horses will absolutely love them. Mmm. These are really, really good. Really. Yeah, they're supposed to be for a horse, not a horse's, ah, uh, well, be. I can say that, right? No, maybe these not. Are, wait a minute, these are not for humans? <laughs> no, they're not. I mean, you can physically eat one. If you like them, honey, I'll make you a whole bunch. What? <laughs> oh, all right.